for a weird race that's coming up. Hi, Camby. So this is what we're talking about, these toilet bowl races, and you're going to see different ones. These are how they put it together like a bicycle, but people do different things. In fact, there's even an outhouse that you'll see racing. It's all up to your own interpretation of what you want to do. This is at the Fair Oaks Fiesta. So we have the honorary mayor. Rachel, what is other things that are going to be happening at the Fair Oaks Fiesta besides the toilet bowl races? It's an all-day thing. It starts bright and early. There's a sun run. There's a pancake breakfast. There's the classic car show. This is the 68th annual. Fair Oaks Fiesta. There's the crowning of the new Miss Fair Oaks, our outgoing Miss Fair Oaks, I, Ashley's I know. last day. Ashley, this is a sensitive <laughs> subject. When I asked you, can you can you show the face that you made when I was like, yeah, there's going to be a new Miss Fair Oaks? Yeah. Are you sad? I'm face. so sad. This has been one of the best years ever. Okay, but no, but you got to pass it on. You know, now someone else gets to do it. Yeah, I guess. Yeah, <laughs> I, 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 I could understand that though. I can understand that. Now, Joseph or Joshua, excuse me, you are a, an honorary mayor as well. A junior honorary mayor. Junior. Do yeah. you run for this, or how's this work? Uh, so you turn an application, and then they give you an, an interview, and then they contact you, and we have this big banquet, and that's when they announce it. So. And then what do you have to do? Uh, I pretty much well, my job description is like. You want get, to get Rachel her coffee? Yeah, you <laughs> an intern. That's girl, that's um, exactly. well, I, I try to get the youth involved more in the community. Trying to get people from all the schools around from Fair Oaks, and then uh, pretty much just go and represent Fair Oaks in a good light. By the way, I should tell you guys, they they have school. It starts at 7:50. They were the first ones here. It's usually the kids that we're waiting for, but it was the adults this time around. Okay, get on this thing. We have uh, Kylie's going to be riding it, and this, by the way. Is the trophy the coveted <laughs> of trophy? Of course it is. If you win, I mean, that is great. Mm -hmm. That is great. It'll be one like this, only 2017. Yeah, and this one is for the winner of, of from 2011, but this one, the new one, will say 2017. Of course. Okay, take off on this so we can see how this works. Is there a trick? And you guys have specific rules for these, right? No, there's no there's no specific trick. There's just it's a timed event. Uh, so go as fast as you can. And there's rules on, on what you can do to make it or no? They there's, could do whatever. Yes, there are rules on making the toilet. Uh, it has to include a toilet. And uh, and then you can build around that. How we, competitive is this? Well, it's very competitive. We've had people try to make a, a bucket work. A bucket does not qualify as oh. a toilet. You hear that, well, people? I mean, for some people, I, mm -hmm. I mean, a bucket could qualify as a toilet. <laughs> that's true. That's true. <laughs> but no, it's... Uh, it's uh, the competitiveness is in the building of the structure. Okay. Well, do you want to do any smack talking? They're telling me we need to wrap, but if you want to do some smack talking to your other competitors, I'll give you the forum right here. Go ahead. Well, the Orangeville Grange is going to challenge every one of you to outdo them. I'm only the uh, I'm, I'm only on the uh, team. Building team. Uh -huh. You're part uh, of the I'm, maintenance I'm, crew. Yeah, I'm the maintenance crew, uh, but the Orangeville Grange does challenge all comers this year. Okay, you guys, do you think you're going to take it? I have no idea. Yes, yeah, yes, okay. we do. Okay, yes, good. Do. All right, good. He, he yeah, can be here. You got to be confident bit, in yeah. your toilet. Yeah. <laughs> I'm pretty confident in mine, but I still keep a plunger because you never know. Mm, that's true. <laughs> so he's part of the pit crew. Nah. The pot crew. We'll call him the pot.